so what's up youtube i'm back at it again welcome back to my closet um and today we are doing our ivy park haul y'all this took so long for me to get together and i know y'all are wondering like that dropped months ago like what happened um but it was a struggle it was a struggle to get all of my ivy park stuff and if y'all know me i love beyonce deep okay i'm five concerts in and like when I tell y'all, it, it it was much more than just like the Adidas drop. Um, I had a pair of Darion jeans. Like, listen, the realest of them all had to had to get my stuff. Um, but it was a process, okay? So multiple orders went up on, you know, January what, 18th, 17th. And like literally within hours of me putting in all of my orders, they all came back denied, not going through, we'll send you your money back all of them just like one by one so i was just like scouring the the internet and then shouts out to my aunt yo she she knew how deep it was and helped me get all of this stuff um because it was serious it was serious and i needed my stuff y'all needed my stuff and so it was it was just a process to say the least i'm just happy that i got the stuff that i got um, and one of the main reasons why I wanted to do this video is just to show that you don't need the whole collection in order to dress the collection. Um, I've been seeing a lot of people where, you know, the whole fit head to toe and not a lot of people were able to get all the stuff. But you can still wear it. It's still cute. And you still have like a lot of options. And I feel like people really aren't, you know, showing that. So anyways, let's just get started. Let's get straight into it. Had to give y'all my, my story of it all. So first I have the the orange set which is super super cute um was really really excited about it especially because of the the just the detail like there's a mesh lining in this the back is really cute and it has Ivy Park around the rim now this is one thing that I do like to wear together I like it as a set um the pants or the the shorts are super cute they have the mesh here on the side which i was kind of nervous about i'm not gonna hold y'all just because it does go so far up but i was able to find underwear to fit these that are not thongs thank god um so i've been wearing the the skims the kim kardashian stuff she has like really really high um rise or high waist uh, underwear that come up real high on the sides but they're not thongs so I was really happy and excited about that um so yeah so this is our first option here now I was able to kind of like you know dress this up a little bit with some of my concert t-shirts and I feel like nobody is wearing their concert t-shirts with this stuff and y'all gotta understand everything Adidas everything Beyonce everything previous Ivy Park is all on limits like there's no reason for you to not wear that stuff with this and then it makes better outfits y'all it makes better outfits than you just wearing it with this and then second up I wasn't able to get the burgundy hat but I got the the white one which I was super geeked about because y'all the back is out for curly hair girls okay hello all of this I never can wear hats but finally be thought of me she thought of me and I was just super super excited super geek even though I couldn't get the burgundy one I'm very very happy with this one and I actually really like this with the orange just because it is so bright I think that it's cute though and then this could also be a nice little accent to like a denim fit a full denim fit with like some white gym shoes or even like some blue gym shoes but I really see this with denim though denim in the orange that's the summer vibe so yes Super happy, super excited about this. And for once, I don't have to like smush down my hair to fit up under a hat. Because y'all know it's not happening with this. I'm actually So next, I have the, the Mess Shaw, which is super cute. I'm excited to wear it as like a going out piece. Um, yeah, no. I was geeked when I saw it in, in the PR stuff that she was wearing. By the way, all the PR looks was fire. But one thing that I am going to say about this collection, though, it's very, very confusing with the sizing. And I don't know if that's going to keep on continuing just because um, a lot of the pieces were made to, you know, fit males as well. But y'all, I have a size range out of this world. I have some stuff that is medium. I have some stuff that is extra small. 
and some stuff that is small and it all fits me okay which is weird because I'm normally like a small um, so the fact that I was able to fit a lot of this stuff and it's all different sizes is just kind of weird, but I don't know. I don't know what's up with that. I wish that the Adidas team could talk to it because, because yeah, I don't, I don't get it, but she is cute. I really, really like this and I actually want to see what I can do with this and, um, some other outfits, not just the Ivy Park line, but I love the three stripes coming down. It has Ivy Park on the neckline. And y'all know, if you know me, I'm all about, like, the athletic wear, the athleisure. So I had to get at least one solid, like, through and through jogging set. And I was able to get the pants. Now, I did get these pants in a medium. So on me, they are a little bit oversized. But it's all cool because it's a look. You know, it's a look. Um, with the orange three stripes going all the way down. It does have multiple, multiple pockets in it, which I'm like ecstatic about I recently wore these in Chicago and like was just on foot doing like touristy stuff all day and this was the best thing ever I had all the pockets in the world I didn't have to carry a bag I didn't have to carry a purse so that was cool these are warm okay nobody talks about that these are very very warm but happy that they are happy that they are I the pocket materials are a little bit different along the sides so I would be kind of cautious of that not to put like my keys or anything like that in the in the thinner um, areas where it's just kind of like this I don't even know what to call this type of material but like a windbreaker type of material on one of the pockets or a couple of the pockets actually um, so I would just be cautious of that other than that I love these drawstring works extremely well so I still have a waist in them which is cool but you yeah, know love this and then to go with this I do have the shirt and the the sweatshirt and this has of course the three stripes down not orange which I'm not mad about because that means I could wear this with other stuff too so that's cool um but just very very well made to to say the least and I feel like this is something that I have for a minute all this stuff is stuff that I have for for a good while um no matter what just because it is made so well and I just feel like I'll get a lot of wear out of it. So, but yep, this here, it is long. And this is something I got in a medium. Nope, I misspoke. It's something I got in a small. The pants are in a medium. So this is this big on me. And the pants still fit me, which is just so weird, y'all. The sizing is so weird. But still here for it. You know, we know. It's cool. I think they even have the measurements online. But at the same time, it's just, you know, ordering stuff online is just so iffy. And then when all this drops, you're just trying to get stuff. So it doesn't even matter. Like, you just want to get what you can to have it and to to keep. So, yeah. Next, anyway. I got both the shirts. Just because I thought that these were cute and I could get them. So, like, why not? Um, and I got one in a small and... This one is an extra small, but they fit me virtually both the same, which is so, y'all, so weird. But I like both of them. I like the cream moment, and I feel like I can even pair this with the orange stuff or just with, like, some lighter denim to begin with, very summer. I feel like that's the one thing that they did do well with this. They got you, like, some fall hookups and some summer stuff as well that actually looks like you're not really just trying to wear this stuff. Um, so... That's cool, and they're both bomb. They're both very, like, lightweight. They do have kind of, like, this high-low effect, which is cute. You know, just a little different details. So, yep, both of these. And then I got the pants, y'all. These track pants are fire, okay? They are fire. They are awesome. But the measurements are just a little weird. Just, just a little bit. Just a little bit weird. Um, so... They zip open on the side here for you to like step into them because if you had to like put these on with the waist in here like you wouldn't be able to get into them because the waist is small but then like the thighs and the legs open up. So you zip in here and then there's a drawstring in here for your waist up top. You can have kind of like a little ankle moment in these because they do open four buttons up which I think is really cute. Um, the only thing that I am worried about with these, but I'm going to still find a way to work it. 
um, is just the the how high they do go and just like the the waist of it all is just kind of weird but still very cute I can really see this with the uh, mesh top that I showed y'all earlier with just the sleeves the mesh top with like maybe a little bralette moment you know that's kind of like that same color with like some nude heels or like even the clear heels that they have too so that's for sure an outfit that is going to happen this summer. Last but not least from the actual collection, um, I was able to get the skirt. Now I was really, really excited about this y'all because the skirt to me was just like one of the cuter items of the collection and it wasn't just like, you know, you're wearing uh, jogging pants or just like a shirt, but like really cute. And then like they have the, the little pockets here in the front that extend longer than like the actual skirt itself which is cute it gives you kind of like this army combat moment um but like still a skirt and still cute um this does completely button down so you know if you have some type of uh i've seen people wear like different colored shorts or like designer shorts up under the skirt which i think is just cute and just different all around um so yeah, so that's cute. Now this is in a medium and I feel like some of their women's stuff was like really, really true to size. Um, when I first got like my first initial order, I got this in an extra small, which y'all, I was busting out of. Okay, but I was going to make it work. I was going to stay in the gym every single day this summer and it was just going to work. It was just going, it was going to be it. It was going to be it. I even talked about taking it to like one of our tailors. You know, just inserting like a little bit of burgundy fabric in the back. Like it's going to be in the back. Ain't nobody going to care. But no. Who who was I fooling? So I had to, you know, send it back. And luckily I was able to get my hands on a medium. Now this is a little bit big for my taste. But that is fine. I actually have multiple skirts that I'll put like a stitch or two in in the back. And then, you know, as we get, you know, bigger, older. You just let it out a little bit and so on and so forth until you can fit it. So I'm happy about that because that means that this will be in my closet for a very long time. So yeah, so that is all the Ivy Park pieces that I have. Now one thing that I did still want to bring out was my like better Adidas and just like, like I said, my Beyonce concert t-shirts and like y'all everything is on limits so i have this one shirt that is from the detroit versus everybody club with adidas got the three stripes on the side and it's just like super cute for you know just a, a rego i'm throwing this stuff on not really trying but it's black so it still matches you know it's not like it's uh like yellow or anything like that off the wall that will really clash with these colors and then of course i am wearing my on the run shirt I want to say they even still have on the run apparel on her website as well that isn't too expensive. So that's still stuff that y'all can, you know, get. Same thing with the Adidas stuff. All things Adidas is on limits. All things Beyonce is on limits. Um, and then I have my Formation World Tour concert t-shirts. I love concert tees. If you saw my uh, closet haul, I'll put that, you know, somewhere in this video. Um, please go watch that. I talk about my t-shirts in depth. And I just have a ton of t-shirts. If you ever go to a concert, they have some of the best t-shirts you can get. I preferably like the dates on the back. That's just me. And um, I also just wanted to mention my Adidas slides. Now these aren't like the regular slides. Because like they have them, but they have like a hard bottom. I actually think that these are kids. But like the biggest size that I can get. Because the bottom is like really, really squishy and like giving. Um, and I have really, really high arches. So I just recommend these, even if you don't get anything else from this video. These slides are bomb. They're great to just like throw on, especially, you know, if you're just like running, doing errands, you're going to go get your nails done. I love these slides. And then last but not least, Yeezys are on limit, y'all. They are on limit um, for all of this stuff. And nobody is wearing their Yeezys with this stuff. And it's just, I think it's just so weird. And I don't know if it's because people are just like diehard Beyonce fans or what. But where are these, y'all? Where are these? I, I recently went to Chicago. And when I had on the jogging pants, this is what I paired it with. So, please um, let me know if y'all are able to get stuff. What are you looking to get in the next drop? You know, what do you think is cute? What do you not think is cute? Please let me know. Like, comment, and subscribe.